Resources for veterans in North Carolina continue to expand with an emphasis on addressing mental health after service in the military. The Stephen A. Cohen Military Family Clinic at Hope for the Warriors in Jacksonville celebrated its official launch this morning. Lucy Nelson has tonight's Home of the Brave segment. She has details on how the clinic is providing resources for veterans and their families. The fight got very real here in Jacksonville and we didn't have the resources that we needed. CEO and co-founder of Hope for the Warriors, Robin Kelleher, knows firsthand how hard the transition can be, not just for service members coming back from deployment, but also for their spouses and families. Her husband served as a Marine and they moved to Camp Lejeune, where he was immediately deployed to Iraq. When I was going through the deployments and my husband came home for the third time, he was a very different person. Um, we had just had our second child and it was a very difficult time as a family. It's a very interesting transition back and there's, it requires experienced people to help bring families back together. And we didn't have that at the time. She made it her goal to get these resources for military families. Now making it official with the help of the Cohen Veterans Network in the place where the idea was born, Jacksonville. With having that much of a military presence, ideal place for this clinic for people, whether they're active, they're out, there's families because the whole family serves. Medal of Honor recipient Staff Sergeant Ryan Pitts talked about his family's struggle with his own form of depression after serving in Afghanistan, where he saw several fellow Marines die. He says picking up the phone for counseling saved his life. If you wore the uniform, walk in that door and you can get the help that you deserve. 